and the height is given as 3.118 meter it means that the second node coordinate system will be 1800 the second point will be x axis will be 1800 and y axis will be 3118 and z axis will be 0 so here is the second point Similarly, we will define the third key point or in our case it is node and it is the third node and its coordinate system will be 3600, 0. Again click on an active CS third node 3600 and the y value will be 0 and now you can see this triangle ha having three nodes first node second node or key point and third key point are defined similarly other key points will be defined now the fourth uh, node coordinates will be 5400 and 3118. Again, click here for 5400 and 5400 plus 1800 it's 7200 7200 0 apply now the 6th will be 7200 plus 1800 9000 and 3118 apply the seventh node will be 9000 plus 1800 10800 and it will be 0 so in this way all the key points are defined now let us check that if we have defined the coordinates correctly you can use this utility menu click on list key point coordinates only and here you can check the coordinates these are the rotation angles rotations as we do not have any rotation so these are all zero z are all zero and you can see the alternative values using this klist command if i type command klist you can access this too For example, I have created this two key point incorrectly. So how I will delete the key point? Under the modeling menu, go to delete and delete key points. Now select this key point. This key point is selected. Similarly, you can select other key points. 
and then click OK. The second key point is now deleted. Let me redefine it. Create key points inactive CS. It was 2, 1800, and 3118. It is now again defined. Now uh, let me save my model. I will save my model. at F right click new folder trust trust video tutorial I will have created the folder now close it go to file click save as here F and under this type the name trust 2D trust click OK file save now you can see this file is created let me close this, save everything. Now I am expecting a new save file in the same folder, the same 2D trust. You can enter the file is now open, but the uh, key points are now not displayed. So I will go to plot key points and then key points. These are the key points. Now let us create some lines. In modeling go to create lines in active coordinate. Select first point. Now similarly this and that. As I have randomly selected, I have want to delete it. So cancel it. And then instead of create, go to delete. Lines only. This line, this line, okay. I have to be careful while creating the lines. If I go to straight line, then it will be easy for me click again and then click similarly click here click here first two three then from third to fourth connect this I think I missed this one I will click OK. Now I will go to delete lines only and I want to delete this line. OK. Now create lines straight line. Select this, select this, then this, click here, then click here, click here and then this, click here, then click here. By clicking I mean left click. So now click OK. Let me save the job so I can check the lines go to list and click on lines 
attribute format, radius format, attribute format. And you can see the number of lines, which means the number of members, length, etc. Now uh, we will mesh the geometry using the mesh tool. So let us do the meshing. For meshing in the main menu under preprocessor use the meshing menu and then use the mesh tool. Click on mesh tool. The mesh tool window is now displayed. You can uh, place the window where it is feasible for you. Find the material properties, real constant and element type etc. As we are having uh, only one material property and only uh, one element type. So let me select only the global so that whatever I will assign it will be assigned globally click on set as we have defined only one link element material number only one we have defined only one material and real constant we have defined only real one real constant click ok Control, click on set and then pick all 